Hello class, in this video we're going to draw our color wheel with all 12 colors. It helps if you first draw the primary colors in a kind of triangle shape. And you can do circles or you can make them other shapes. So if you want them hearts or stars or flowers, you can do that. I'm just going to keep it simple with circles, so I'm going to have my yellow, and it helps if you label right away too. And then I'm going to come down to the corner and have my blue, and then the other corner, my red. So I have my primary in kind of a triangle shape. Then in between those, I'm going to make my secondary. And it's okay if when you draw it, it doesn't end up being a perfect circle, as long as things are in the right place. So between yellow and blue should be the secondary green. Between yellow and red should be the secondary orange. And then between blue and red should be the secondary violet, also known as purple. Then we have to put our tertiaries in. Those are the ones that are the mix of a secondary and a primary. So then I put those in between. So yellow, green, and I'm just going to put Y dash G. Then in between yellow and orange, yellow, orange. Then between red and orange, red, orange. Between red and violet, red, violet between blue and violet, blue, violet, and between green and blue, blue, green. And you'll notice I always say the primary color first and then the secondary color second for those ones. So you see mine didn't turn out to be a perfect circle and that's okay. Because right now I can change things around, edit it. If I want to bring my circle in, I did this in pencil so I could erase and then bring it in a little, or maybe I like it like that and I keep it right there. So now all I have to do is either color or find objects to fill in with these. So I can either get some color construction paper and make, if I want to stay with the circle theme, cut out circles, or I could change it up and maybe now I, I make hearts or something. So I find my red and I put red there. Or, if I want to use magazines, that might help you with some of the intermediate or tertiary colors. So if I couldn't find a good um, color, I might look in magazines and I see there's some nice, like, this is a nice yellow green, so maybe I cut that out for yellow green. Or I could, don't have blue construction paper, so I cut out some blue for that. Or another fun thing is to actually get objects from your house that are those colors. So I have a yellow highlighter, I might put that down. Or I have um, a blue hand cream, I could put that down. Or I have blue green post-it notes, I could use that. Or maybe I have a plant, I could put the plant down. And I could just find objects that fit those categories and then take my picture and send it in. There's lots of objects you can find around your house. You can ask your parents if you can find stuff in the kitchen or just get things at your desk like I'm doing. So I found an orange glue stick. I have a yellow green sharpener. And just keep looking until you find what you need. So sometimes it might take you a little bit and that's okay. Just try to find things for all 12 of the colors. Alright, I hope you guys have fun creating.